Hello everyone, in this video I am going to show you that how you can add custom HTML section into your Shopify store. So this video is specific for the people who installed debut theme. For other themes I will also upload the video but you have to subscribe the channel so that you get the notification for other videos too. So let me show you first of all the benefit of this custom HTML section. So I have another store which is uh, for the Brooklyn theme. So they have already given some custom HTML section. So you can see on the left hand side we have custom HTML. So down below actually I was interested to add a video which should auto play and uh, that should be added according to me. So this is possible only if you have the option to add your own code. So on the right hand side you can see that actually uh, when you will click on custom HTML this section on the right hand side you will get an option of adding your code. So I have added the video tag and because of which this video is appearing over here and this is repeating over and over again and this is too beautiful as well. So I will be showing you same thing on the debut theme that how is it possible over there. So you can see that if you will click on add section then you will no more able to see any section of custom HTML because uh, in this theme that section is not available. So let me tell you how we can uh, make it happen. So first of all you should go to your dashboard of the Shopify store. So currently you can see that we have debut theme. Then after you should click on actions, click on edit code and then after you will be getting some uh, folders and files so you should click on sections then you should click on add a new section here you should add custom dash html then click on create section so this section is created now you should scroll it down and down below you will be getting a, getting a file of rich dash text dot liquid click over it copy this whole bunch of code from here and then paste everything over here but before that you should remove this code and then paste it here. Now the third step is that you should uh, change the name of this. So here you can see that uh, there are multiple languages so if you are specific for uh, any language then you can modify accordingly but I am also going for the English language here we have rich text so I am going to change it to custom HTML. So same thing I am going to copy from here and I will scroll it down and down below there will be another option of adding it. So here you can see that this is preset. So here also we have en English and instead of rich text I am going to add custom HTML. These are the two changes and the third change is that you should change the type of this uh, specific section. So here we have the type which is rich text. Keep in mind that this is rich text. So I am going to add here text area. Text area. Alright. So spelling is T-E-X-T-A-R-E-A. -E -E. Then you are done. Now you should save these changes. And let's refresh this page again. So once you refreshed this page, then, it, then that section should be appearing over here. Click on add section. Then you can see that we have other options like show more. And here you can see that we have custom HTML. So click over it. And here we go. We have the title. If you are interested to add any title, you can also add. Otherwise you can remove and that would be disappearing from here. So for example, I am writing here custom video. Alright, and down below we have the option to add our code. So I am going to remove this code and going to add the video which I was just talking about for the Brooklyn theme. Just you can see that we have this video on the Brooklyn theme. But now I am going to add the same thing for my debut theme. So what you need to write here is video src equals to double quotes. And before that you can write here controls. And then you can write here muted, then you can write here loop, then place inline. I already uh, made a video on uh, how to add the video on your Shopify store. So I will add the link below in the description. So you should watch that video. But for, the, uh, for just completing this video, I'm going to add here. Place inline, place inline. Then after we have 
yeah that's it so in the source we are going to add uh, that specific uh, video link so I already uploaded a video here let me click on settings so down below you will be finding files and here I already uploaded a video which is this one I'm going to click on copy link and then after you should add here the link so now the video appeared here and you should write here width equals to 100% so here we go you can see that this is pretty fine so let me see what is missing here so you can see that muted plays inline autoplay right this autoplay attribute should be over here so let me write here auto play that's it so now you should save these changes and this should work so let's see the preview of this one click on view then let's see you can see that this video is auto playing uh, let's see if it is auto playing or not uh, seven seconds are completed and now again auto play so that means auto play is working fine one last thing I wanted to share with you is that I have already created one beautiful website for free which is keywords.com k-e-i-w-o-r-d-s.com and I have a couple of tools uh, for SEO people and YouTubers specifically if you are a YouTuber then you can also find the tools for YouTube uh, videos if you have uh, you are interested to find keyword volume checker then you can also see here for example I am uh, checking the books keyword volume so here you can see that there is a beautiful way to uh, find all the things and also find the related keywords and stuff and if you are a youtuber then you can generate uh, tags description extract tags from others videos create the thumbnail hashtags title channel edit and all the things so share this video share this specific uh, website to your friends and uh, the people who are connected with you because this is free of cost so you can use it so i hope that you enjoyed the video if you are thinking this video was useful for you then please subscribe the channel and also like this video and also tell me below in the comment section that what the other thing that you are missing and because of which i could uh, create the video for your help all right so thank you so much once again see you in the next video